You are designing a fashion range. What is that one thing you should have in your inventory? Fabric. Fabric is to fashion what paint is to art. But just fabric? Plain fabric? You need something more to spice up your collection. And what's that something more? Color. I had two options. I could teach you color theory in a drab classroom with a whiteboard. Boring. Or I can teach you everything about color amidst color. We get color when we refract white light through a glass prism. Do you know the average human eye can detect 350,000 different colors? Now that is the entire spectrum of colors. Colors we get when we refract white light through a glass prism. The basis of color theory is the color wheel. Primary colors, red, yellow, blue. Colors that you cannot get by mixing other colors. Secondary colors, orange, violet, green, colors you can obtain by mixing two primary colors. Opposite colors on the color wheel are complementary colors, neighboring colors, analogous colors. A pure color or hue with white added is tint and with black added shade. Polychromatic has many colors. Monochromatic, one color. Different colors have different meanings. Blue and green have a calming effect. Why do you think hospital scrubs are colored blue and green and not some wild red? Red denotes excitement. Black is about sophistication. Green can be also about nature and the environment. Yellow is happy and sunny. It's a mood elevator. Every season, color forecast has a huge impact on pretty much every aspect of our lives. Fashion, clothing, accessories, furnishings, makeup, automotives. And these are dictated by the current moods and preferences, social and cultural events. Some colors are popularized by celebrities, events. For example, Olympic Games every four years brings out a palette of sporty colors. We get our color forecasts from agencies like Pantone. So what do you think? They just wake up one morning and decide it's color purple for 2023? It's not that simple. Intense research, analysis and discussions go into color forecasts for a season. Some color palettes are staples. For instance, summer is almost always dictated by whites and pastels and winter by autumn hues. Cool colors for summer and warm colors for autumn winter. Social conventions and symbolic meaning are attached to different colors. We have to study these in the context of different cultures. For instance, white is the color of weddings in the West. 
in India and China, it's the color of mourning. A Western bride wears white. An Asian bride wears red or green. Color of mourning varies from black to white. Those were a few basic principles of color theory. In the next video, how to impart color to fabric and also most importantly, how to use color to your advantage. So till next time, this is Savita signing off from Tesla Tulip Festival. Bye for now. Cheerio.